Okay, hi everyone. Here's a little odd video for something in Photo Pro magazine, or maybe it's Pro Photo magazine. Uh, this is September 2010. Now, this magazine, this is one that I've got a subscription for, but there's something odd about uh, one of the adverts in it. Let me show you. Here is the selection of the Pro team, and uh, you've got all the people here and all the contributors to it. Um, Damien Lovegrove this guy here, I think his work is really good, I'll show you that in a second. But there's also this other person, Mark Cleghorn, who does lots of kind of internet teaching and DVDs and stuff like that. But I just want to show you something about his advert in here. So first of all, Damien Lovegrove, let's look at him. Uh, this guy, pro columnist, uh, I definitely agree with that. He is definitely very good. He's done these kind of vintage looking uh, portraits where it's he's gone to these old fashioned train stations throughout the UK, which he says there's around about 140 heritage train stations. And he's got uh, a couple models and done some cool shots. He's done some really good editing to the images to give it that vintage look. And uh, I'm just really impressed with them. Um, this guy's work is is always kind of top notch. He always has some pretty good models as well. So big thumbs up to Lovegrove. Now Mark Cleghorn, he's also a professional photographer and does lots of stuff. And you can see him all over the internet. Uh, his shots are, are usually stylistically very different. Here he's talking about how to um, fill in shadows that if you've got like a dappled effect from maybe trees or leaves uh, on the wedding and how to use some like fill in flash or uh, with using reflectors uh, to get that going. And uh, so generally this guy is, I would say is pretty good, but there's something which is a bit odd. Uh, this is effectively his advert, the biggest and best photography training company in Europe, uh, phototrainingforyou.com. This is pretty much all Mark Cleghorn's stuff. And uh, on this full page advert, uh, he's telling you that he makes three films every week, learn how to earn 10,000 each month. Hmm, interesting. Um, and yeah, so a month is about 15 pounds. Anyway, and, and it shows you some of his shots, which are all kind of fairly cool. So, you know, quite stylistic, quite harsh lighting to very soft lighting and all that kind of stuff. But my question is, why on earth has he used this photo for his main big one? Not because it's a bad photo, it's a very pretty model and all that, but they're purple. Whatever editing he has done to this image, it's given their skin tones, well it's just made it terrible. I don't know whether that was intentional. I don't think it's a printing problem because this is a photography magazine and all his other photos are looking really good there. But for this main one, she actually is purple. This isn't this camera, she is actually purple. And his skin just looks like he's got the worst purple acne I've ever seen. Very strange choice of editing for a photo that he's put for his main advert. So my question to you guys, have any of you used phototrainingforyou.com? And if you have, or even if you've watched some of his videos, tell me what you think of Mark Cleghorn and uh, what you think of his shots as well. And tell me what would you have used if you were using a full page advert? What would you use for your main picture? Tell me what you think. Cheers.